Hello, hello, Sharon here, and I'm going to be showing you a real quick tip on how to change your view layouts really, really quickly and easily. So if you normally go to the ribbon up here and go across to view and then change your layout this way, then there is actually a quicker way. Microsoft Office has made it a bit easier for us, so we don't have to use the ribbon if you don't need to. All you need to do is look down into the bottom right corner of your screen and you will see some icons across here which are also view layout options. The first one's focus mode. If you click on that, it gets rid of all the distractions that are on the screen and just leaves you with your document. You're literally just focused 100% on your main document in front of you. And then to come out of there, just press escape and it brings you back to your normal layout. The next one across is read mode and this kind of sets it out like a book. So you're reading the pages left to right instead of scrolling up and down. You use these arrow keys and scroll across instead. The next layout is the print layout. Now this is actually the default view um, when you first open your Word document. And the final one is the web layout. This shows you what it would look like if it was on a web page. So that's just a real easy way of changing your view layout without having to use the ribbon each time. So we'll just put it back to print layout. Another real handy feature of Word is if you're in the view option on the ribbon and in the show section here, there's one called navigation pane. If you tick on there and go across to pages, this, this is where it now shows you the thumbnails of each of your page and you can easily just jump to a page where, that you want to format and jump back again and then to, to get rid of that again you can either untick or just click the cross here and it goes back and there you have two real quick and easy ways of getting to view your page how you want it i really hope you found that helpful thanks for watching and until next time bye for now